Hello all, welcome back to our favorite V and Data channel. Today, let us begin with statistics. Let us get into the video. As discussed, let us start with to revise. So let's see the basics. The first thing is count. So what is count? Let us take a sample, okay, like this. Uh, we consider we have some oranges or apples or oranges anything so totally this is a sample size now we count these oranges uh, this is sample so now we count the oranges like 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so we have 10 oranges so this is the count 10 is the count next we'll see what is count missing now we draw a column with five rows Okay, we have five values. One, two, three, four. Here the count is five because there are five values. Here the not null value is four. Okay that is 1 2 3 4 they are not null values so null value there is one blank space so the null value is 1 this null value is the missing count next we will see sum we have values from 1 to 5 some of these numbers are 1 plus 2 3 3 plus 3 6 6 plus 4 10 10 plus 5 15 so the total sum is 15 this is what the sum is if these values are placed in a column c1 okay in this column 1 2 3 4 5 then the sum of this column c1 Okay, the sum of this column C1 will be 15. Next, we will see mean. Mean and average are uh, nearly same. So, we take values from like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So the formula to find this mean is it is simple uh, we have to write sum of numbers divided by the total count. Here it is 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 plus 10 divided by the total count is we have 5 numbers so it is 5 which is 6 now our mean is 6 
we get 6 uh, it may be any value depending upon the distribution it, it is not like we have to get 6 only not like that it may be depend so next we will see what is standard deviation To tell in simple words the distribution from the mean value it is what standard deviation is uh, for our previous example 2 4 6 8 10 here 6 is the mean so from this 6 how much distribution is there this is what standard deviation is the formula for this is square root of x value minus square root of mean the whole square divided by count minus 1 so to tell in simple words in a normal distribution curve the mean will be in center in a normal in normal distribution curve we have mean value at the center like that 6 is at the center from this center how much the values are distributed is the standard deviation So then next comes standard error. Now we have one sample 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. For this 6 is the mean. We have uh, more number of samples like this. Let us take uh, like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 it is one sample so for this the mean is 3 and next we have 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 for this 8 is the mean now we have 3 different means we take this 3 mean as a sample so it will be in 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 so we have all 3 means in this sample for this mean we will find another one mean and we will tell it as mean of mean. To be in simple find a mean for all the sample and then find the mean for those mean. So standard error is finding the distribution for this new mean, mean of mean. Today we have discussed about count, count missing, sum, mean, standard deviation, standard error. In our next video we will discuss about the hands on part using python for all these concepts. Until then it is bye from our favorite V and data channel.